Hey guys, it's Edible Fruits here, and today I'm coming with, I mean, I guess you could say it's a comeback video, I, I mean, uh, reintroducing to my channel almost. So recently, about a month and a half ago, I decided to, I guess, take a break from YouTube. I told my friends and everybody that was like, where did you go, Barrett? I said I was quitting YouTube, and I, I thought I meant it. What had happened was high school had started, I just became a freshman, and I thought that it was just going to be too much for me to be editing videos, recording videos all the time, and my phone goes off, but editing videos, recording all the time, and just being busy. I didn't think I was going to have enough time for it, but I mean, things have cleared up as the year's gone on. I'm on a week break right now, and I should have my computer around me, so... I mean, one of the biggest things that inspired me to bring this back was the fact that if you searched on YouTube my channel name, Edible Fruits, uh, you would always get a bunch of randomly blah blahs of commercials of fruit, like the edible fruit packages, like the little table center things. And I mean, that would piss me off so much because people would message me all the time and be like, hey, I can't find your channel. Can you help me out here with a link? And I'm like, sure. And I always got so irritated because that was probably the number one thing that stopped my growth. The number one thing that was stopping me from getting to that thousand subscribers or whatever milestone I could set. And now when you search on YouTube edible fruits, and I want you guys to try this for me and tell me if I'm just hallucinating or something. If you actually search it now on YouTube, my channel actually comes up first instead of a bunch of freaking fruit videos. And all of my videos are down below it. A couple co-op videos I've done with friends are there as well. And I thought that was just so freaking amazing. I, it was awesome. I thought I could finally find my channel without having to browse through fruit videos or search for a certain video. Um, one of my videos also just hit 1,500 views, which really isn't that much, but for a YouTube channel with just over 250 subscribers, that's pretty insane. And some of my other videos have hit over 750 and around 300, and that was pretty exciting as well. So all these things are coming together, and all these things that I saw as I looked on there, I also looked on there and saw I quit two videos away from 100 videos, and I can't believe I did that. I didn't realize it. And I now am coming back and I'm just like, oh, well, this is going to be my 99th video. What am I going to do next? That I've got to figure out. I've got to figure out what to do for my 100th video. If you have any ideas for me, put it down in the comments if I actually am going to get any views on this video. Because I'm probably going to be super inactive subscriber-wise. But whatever, I can get you guys back. I can bring you back to the fruit land. So, what I intend to do so far with the channel uh, when I'm coming back here is honestly I'm just going to really make one to two videos a week because of my busyness and upwards. So, during the weekend, I'll probably just be recording constantly, filling up my hard drive with every possible whim that I could put in there and live streaming. Whenever I'm playing, I'm either going to be recording or live streaming. And yeah, that'll be cool. So I can get some Daisy videos because I'm, I'm falling in love with Daisy Epoch. Daisy Epoch is pretty sick. So yeah, that's going to be pretty cool. And um, live streaming every day that we, during the weekend. So what happens is, is Monday through Thursday, I stick my computer in the closet just mostly because I don't want to be distracted and I want my brain on school. So then on Friday afternoon, after I'm done with school and studied a little bit, I will bring my computer out and decide to play some video games. So after that, I will be making videos Friday, Saturday, Sunday, if I have time. Obviously, I have a girlfriend, I have friends, I have things that I need to do, swim meets, all that fun stuff, stuff that I have to attend to, and I will continue to attend to. So, yeah, I mean, thank you guys so much that you actually watched this video and caught it. It means a lot, and so, yeah. Feel free to subscribe if you haven't already, and remember to come back and watch me some more. So, check out my live stream. I'll see you guys later. Have a nice day.